so sorry for the bad lighting um it's gone it's coming up oh my god baby's 10 to 9 how long's food gonna be i didn't even realize how late it was christian sorry. I didn't, did you realize the time what? did you realize the time what? it's 10 to 9 yeah. oh my god how long is that gonna be five minutes yeah don't you put the pasta in only in like okay. My God, it's literally ten to nine. I didn't. Remember. It's because we had that extra hour today, so everything's just gone a little bit all over. But I'm trying to look for some um, pampas grass um, decor for in our bedroom because we're redoing our room, and we really love like well for the whole house really like the Scandinavian type feel. All, all the pictures that we like of rooms that we see in the house are all from like Sweden and Germany and places like that and it's all like oh, quite oh, neutral and um, Scandinavian -y, but with like a modern twist so in the corner of our room um, we're wanting to get like um, a floor vase with some big leaves coming out of it um, some pampas leaves some pampas grass sorry so I'm trying to look for some and I've, they've got it all on Etsy which is super cheap for the, the it's literally like for 140 meter centimeter pampas grass stems it's only like 10 pound for four or like um, 9 for 115 centimeters long um, so it's not too expensive but it's the vases that are expensive me? i'm just talking you're just there oh. I'm, you just now that you're looking at me i'm talking yeah. to you because yeah. like the, the, unless you're going for like a not nice vase, like the vases are about sixty pounds. It's not to find a nice vase, isn't it? Yeah, but then like the pompous leaves aren't too expensive, so I'm just trying to have a little look for that. We have been busy doing some TikToks today. We had so much fun, didn't we, doing our TikToks? Yeah. With you. <laughs> Oh, oh God, that hurt. Oh, that hurt, that did. But yeah, so I'm just having to look, looking at some of these. I'm also reading, I'll probably do like just half an hour worth of ironing because I still haven't done that, believe it or not. Um, and then I'm going to do my nighttime skincare routine, which I will take you through. So just had some Ben and Jerry's cookie dough ice cream after dinner. Now I'm about to go and just get ready for that. But I'm just gonna load the dishwasher first. I was gonna wash and um, hand wash, but can't be bothered. Can't be bothered. for the lighting in here it can be quite quite white and quite bright so this one's gonna tie my hair up my hair feels lovely after that face mask that face mask that hair mask I did earlier I might have to look into purchasing some of that I'd never heard of the brand before but the exfoliating shampoo it's lovely right I'm just gonna wash my hands first because I'm gonna touch my face with dirty hands and I'm doing it. No. So what I'm gonna use first is the pharmacy um cleansing balm that I showed you earlier. I think I showed you earlier. Okay. Which is this green clean makeup cleansing balm and it's literally just like a little green balm that I use. Really don't need a lot, a little does go a long way. It's this much on my finger. Then I just rub it in and put it on like that. I feel like it's so much nicer to use a balm for your skin because I find, I mean, I, I don't use makeup wipes anymore. They, um, 
I have them on the ship because sometimes after a show, especially when we were doing cats, I used to use, well, not I, we all would use um, coconut oil to get the majority of the makeup off and then it would all get into your hairline and then I'd get yellow, because I had a yellow and orange and white face, yellow, orange and white, all in, like, on my pillowcase and stuff, so... I used to have makeup wipes just to get into my hairline and in my ears and things like that. But usually, I wouldn't use um, makeup wipes. I find them too harsh for your skin. So I like to use a balm with my own um, fingers. This is the lovely looking part. Put it onto the eyes. And a good thing as well, so if you can't hear me over the tap, it's an electric tap, so I've got to keep it on. It's because it's mainly, well, I think it is, it's a clean brand. Um, it doesn't sting or anything, in it. it just feels really lovely and it smells. Oh, <laughs> it smells stunning as well. So then I go in with the Liz Earl. That's a bit dusty, that one. Ooh, Emily. Um, the Liz Earl Cleanse and Polish. Just going to take a few pumps into my fingertips. And then rub that in. And then I'm going to take one of the muslin cloths. This is, it comes with the um, Cleanse and Polish. Run that underneath the tap and wipe. These are so much better to have as well instead of um, makeup wipes. It's just so much better, I think, for your skin and then also for the environment as well. Because obviously, makeup wipes they do contain shush. Makeup wipes do contain um, plastic. Um, which I never knew until about a year or so ago. So use that and then rinse it. I am going to use my Ferreo, which is, hold on. Sorry, I'm back. I have to get my phone for the app to use my Ferreo. So this is what it looks like. It's this little device and you could take this off and that's what you put on to secure the mask. It's got heating, cooling, and lighting therapy. So what you do is I will scroll to my health app. Go in there, and that's my Ferreo app. Click on that. Turn this on. Hold it the button down. And then it starts flashing. And then you're gonna do, there you go, and then start the UFL. And then I've got, all these masks, this is what I usually keep um, my cotton pads in, but I haven't got any at the moment. So the mask in here at the moment that I've got is, this is the Make My Day Hyaluronic Acid and Red Algae Mask. I have a Glow Addict, which is an Enhanced Brightening Pearl Infused Mask. They're all Glow Addict. And then I also have the Call it tonight, which is full of ginseng and olive oil. We should did that last night, so I'm actually I like I save these if I do them in the morning. The Freya the Freya is really good to use before you do your makeup and all your skincare in the morning as well. If I'm going out for like a day or say if it was like a wedding or something, I'd use that before. So I'm gonna use the glow addict one. Skin and pretty much every time any time that I've used this, um people have said your skin looks really nice. So I think it's like £200 for the actual um, device. Then each mask, I think the Make My Day one and the Call It A Night one, they're 9 99 for a box of six or seven. But then any others, they're usually like 19 99 dollars. I don't know what that would be in pounds. Because I've always, I order them from online. So what you're gonna do, I can show you, this is super messy. So this is the mask. Don't worry, I'll show you in a second, it's just, Getting it everywhere. I'm also just gonna rub that. <laughs> you got so much use out of these masks as well. So as you can see here, 
Don't need to go over there. I've put the mask over the top like that. And then the, the Ferreo clip. You just... Oh, God, it's messy business. This one um, mask doesn't quite seem to fit right. I think it's a little bit too small, but... So we have to do a bit of faffing around. So it's on now. I've clipped it on. And then I always like to squeeze the rest of the mask to get every last cent of my $20 mask. <sighs> and then, here, you press start, which is the black button there. Start. And then you, there's a barcode. You want to scan. Secure the UFO activated and then she talks to you. Device by clipping the attachment ring so it's place. click the logo facing which up. one I've got. And then I'm going to press start. Use a circular motion. As you gently glide UFO across your face and neck. Well, this Just one's really quite liquidy. Evenly. <gasps> but then once it's on. While a soothing warmth preps the skin. So it's getting hot now. Benefits of this brightening complex. And it tells you as well what it is doing. Begins helping to this is green LED and down. thermotherapy. Which brightens the complex. Helps to even out your skin tone. And it's quite meditative, meditative as well. Meditative, is that the right word? Sometimes I'm literally in here and I'm like, and I'll do it like two or three times to get the most out of it. Because as you can see on my face, it's quite watery. But by the time I've done it two or three times, I really Experience feel like a relaxing facial now it's vibrating. As T sonic pulsations combine with a gentle warmth to infuse brightening pearl extract into your skin for a luminous complexion. There you go. So yeah, sometimes I'll do it two or three times to really make it soak into my skin and then nine times out of ten I don't really add any skincare but I might add just a little bit extra um I might use a moisturizer tonight. Just for extra moisture locking. While green LED continues to perfect really your warm skin, now. So forget the next leave you with a healthy radiant glow. <laughs> And then it goes down, you press stop treatment when it's coming to finish, UFO exit the app, take this off, take that off, put that in the bin, and then hold the button down to turn it off, and I'm just going to literally rinse it under the tap, because it's waterproof, and then dry it, and then you're done. Ready to use another day. These first before I do my moisturiser to make sure it can all soak into my skin and then I also use a tongue scraper this I saw who was it that I was reading off someone on Instagram said how it's good for um, your gut health so the first thing in the morning I used to always have drink, drink a pint of water and then clean my teeth um, because I didn't like to drink, clean my teeth and then drink water because it just tasted awful. So now what I do um, is because of all the like whiteness that you get on your tongue after a night in bed, when you wake up and that's all there and you swallow a pint of water, all that bacteria, whereas it's not horrific bacteria, it's not great bacteria, when you're swallowing it and that's going all the way into your gut, which isn't really very great. So now what I'll do is I'll get up and instead of cleaning my teeth right away, I will um, scrape my tongue, just rinse like around my teeth with some water, and then I'll drink my water, and then I'll clean my teeth, and it just find it so much better. So I'm not going to do this on camera, but it's um, a really useful thing, and like a very, very hashtag wellness, a tongue scraper is. <laughs> and then for my bedtime moisturiser tonight, I am going to use this um, Tatcha the Dewy Skin cream i think this is the most bougie little moisturizer um thing ever and this is an um, ultra hydrating and anti-aging replenishing japanese purple rice for dry skin now my skin isn't necessarily dry my skin is neither here nor there um so I just kind of get what I always get tested and see just what works for my skin um, and I've, I was looking for an anti-aging bedtime cream and this was really the only one that I found 
whilst I was out in America of anti-aging and honestly it is the most richest nourishing cream I've ever had and you also don't need a lot so it comes in it's this kind of like lilac-y coloured There you go. Comes in this like lilac colour. And all you literally need to do, I use a little spatula because I find it comes in healthy. I literally just get like a pea sized amount. That looks like a lot, but it's not. And then I'll just put a bit each. Put that back on. I think this is quite expensive. I want to say it was $68. Um, but I feel like skincare, and I'll just rub it in. You, um, I don't think you, if you want to have good skin, you know, you can't really cut corners. I would much rather have less, and this is kind of what I do basically. I would have rather have less clothes um, and more good quality of makeup. I feel like it's less is more of everything. No, I don't really have um, a crazy amount of products. I don't have a crazy amount of clothes, but the clothes and skincare that I do have, it's all just of like good quality, you know, no product stuff. I'm gonna rub that in, it smells absolutely divine. And then I'm also gonna use the um, Laneige Lip Sleeping Mask as well. This is in berry flavoured. I actually just got my mum this for Mother's Day because when she came on the cruise ship she used it every night so and it is stunning. It tastes so good as well. <laughs> there you go so I'm literally smothered in oils now. <sighs> there we go into my pyjamas. Feels so nice wearing nice pyjamas when I'm on the ships I don't I just take like I slept in harem pants that I got from boohoo.com um, and like just big baggy tops, not matching pyjamas just because it's like comfort on there and god forbid anything happens, you know. I didn't ever want to be in proper pyjamas in case I had to go and get in the lifeboat, which I've had what, um, two scares now with that. Um, so I always want to be in like normal clothes, so it's so nice coming home and getting to be in my lovely just become run matching pyjamas. Right. I don't sleep in jewellery. So I'm going to take all my jewellery off, apart from my engagement ring, I'll keep that on. Oh my goodness, my skin feels so nice. Take this off. I see like pretty much anyone that I see I sleep with jewellery on and I can't, I can't do it. I don't know why. Give the hair a little brush. And this is something that I don't think everyone does, but you should always brush your hair before you go to bed. Okay. This is our little like wellness corner. This is our humidifier. And then this is my little um, rose quartz crystal. And this is an Esper in a Calm, sorry. Esper in a Calm Balm. And then this is a Maya skincare liquid spray that I spray on. Just with everything that's going on, it's just nice to make the air nice and moisture. Take this back. Oh, didn't get to do any ironing today. Oh well, I thought we've got anything else to do. And then I'm just gonna pop it in there and then switch it on. Two silk eye masks that I'll pick from. Probably wear this one because I'm matching. If I want to go to sleep. Um, but I really hope you enjoyed this video. I enjoyed filming this one. 
I'm sh hoping to do a few more of these type vlogs. So let me know in the comments below um, if you enjoyed it, if there's anything else in particular that you'd like to see and I can get those filmed. Um, it's just so nice to be home. So nice to be home. I didn't realise how much I was struggling until I got home. So it's lovely. But yes, thank you so much for watching and I will see you in my next video which I think will probably be around the corner from this one. Hope you're all doing okay. Keep yourself safe, keep yourselves healthy and together we will get through this. So, please make sure to like this video and subscribe to my YouTube channel and I'll see you very soon. Good night.